like a brother. Even Anybody else feel like Hannibal Lecter's locked up in that truck in front of us? It's just a little creepy. I don't know. Hank! God, there's an ATM on the other side of the parking lot he could have used. Really Dodge Challenger. That's my train car. It must be broken. He just pulled away. We're here. You guys, okay. I know people complain about plastic. Imagine all the plastic from freaking baby toys that just go into the landfills. I mean, people buy your baby stuff used, they grow out of it in like two seconds. Use some Lysol wipes, it's all good. Okay, we're here. We have room to record inside. See, all right, guys, we're here at the ark. Here we go. Okay, so we're walking up to the door, and we're on a bit of a slant here, but you know me. I'm the world's greatest cinematographer. So, grabbing my little basket, and it's Customer Appreciation Week. Uh, I don't even know what that means. So, a lot of times I load up here, and sometimes I find nothing. It's, it's all luck of the draw, really. Um, I'm just looking through the purses, looking for either something super expensive or something that I like. And I like little cloth bags, usually. Um, like that one, I thought was really pretty. But the inside, I think, was stained up a bit. Some blazers, some more purses, me twirling around like a ballerina. Here we are coming up on the hard goods area. They always have beautiful giant bladders. Most of the time they're ceramic. Hey, what's that black thing? I end up picking up this. It's like the story of the sand dollar. I think it was a bad pick, but it's pretty. I don't mind having um, the sand dollar in my room. And then there's a floor. We're oh, getting blurry. That's a nice basket, but it's you can tell it's super modern. It's just well put together. And oh my god, you guys! I was like so heartbroken because look at that missing paint on there. You know Blockbuster stuff's gonna be collectible. And then I was looking at that and I was like, I don't understand. <laughs> and let's see. I ended up picking up this planner and I broke them. It was in great condition. But I'll, I'll throw a plant in them. Those were very interesting. I wish I would have shown the markings if it had any. Some melamine type plates. Um, bunch of mugs, glass mugs. That reminded me of like Kay's collection, like Dollar Tree or something. Those are sold. Um, they are going to St. Vincent, St. Lucia in the Caribbean. That's a 
very retro fall mug. I keep saying retro. That's an old fall mug. Vintage. And like if if I knew what I know now, I need to be in the. I need to hurry up and just move along. Cute little trivet, but it was super modern. Somebody donated a refrigerator shelf, which I think is throw away your own trash type of, you know. Very beautiful linen, but it was stained. That's what I was pointing out. Don't know why I left the red crochet thing. That crochet was lace. Ended up picking up these two plates. They're like floral plates. They're good wall plates, but I'm going to end up putting those on eBay. They didn't do, they weren't so hot at the live sale, but you know. They look cool. They've got butterflies and flowers and like ladybugs. Who doesn't like that? Pretty lavender and it's like a chiffon yellow. Okay, and so I'm like, these guys really want to see this refrigerator shelf. And it's a cocktail mixer, I guess. I think when I was a kid, I would use that to stir eggs. seriously looking at the refrigerator shelf. Oh, it's not a refrigerator shelf. <laughs> it's a little shelf or something. Oh, a towel rack. And so here's me, like, spending my time looking through all the junk they got there. And holy moly, what am I about to find? That's an Elvis mug. I think maybe it played music or had something in the bottom. I don't know. Looked at it like three times. Second take, third take. And I'm picking up this little thing. I think he put smelly goods in it. I have it hanging on my lamp in my room. A tall lamp. Still available. That I ended up selling, but I ended up giving it to her for free because she's a good friend of mine. Threw that in her box for her. I thought it was very cute and neat. It was like a giant pincushion thing. Oh my god. Look what I found. Look at that drink set. <laughs> and then I just cut away because I had to scoop it up as fast as I could. But it's sold. And it's super nice. That is Lennox. Those are like mainstays or home, whatever, home decor, and then I'm like, let me show them the marking, and I'm like, let me show them the marking, and you still can't really see it too well, but I left that behind because it was a single, I don't know if that was smart, but I ended up buying that for no reason, it's a little pedestal, just for example. I see signs like crazy around here. I don't know if there's a huge like German population, but uh, I know nothing about them. And that's one thing we need to learn about. I think the Norse came back on. The power of your, I don't know, it's a rock with paint on it. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful ginger jar, but it had no lid. I really thought that had a cool print on it. There's two of them. And I probably debated it for a while. And I was like, these guys need to see these pretty cups. And so I'm trying to do great cinematography for you guys, but it looks like the poop. I ended up getting a set of four of those. They are sold. Um, let's see, let's see. There's always a lot of plates in this place. Oh, back up the truck. So there was this beautiful um, Barnum and Bailey's clown cup, clown cup <laughs> that sold. Um, and I forget what else I got that day, but I think I was in a hurry to scoop something up, so that's why I was just like cutting with it. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed my shaky, shaky shopper. Shopper Shopper Shop Time video and I hope you guys 
are having a great day. And so those are some of the things I flip for a profit. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give it a like, subscribe, share with your friends, and thank you for watching. Bye!